Hey guys, Crypto Dad here again, and today I'm going to show you how to install and set up the Atomic Wallet. So let's get started. Okay, so the Atomic Wallet is a desktop based wallet, it's a multi currency wallet. You can hold a lot of different cryptocurrencies in it. The private key is stored on your device and you're going to get a backup phrase that you will be able to use if something happens to the wallet. If it gets uninstalled or you lose your computer, you'll have that backup phrase to restore all of your cryptocurrency. So let's get going. I'm on their homepage and I'll put a link to this down in the description. Let's just hit download here and choose our platform. And we can just drop this in the downloads folder And I'll open that folder up and start the installation. Like I said, they're going to provide us with a backup phrase when we create this new wallet. And you can see here that when you're reinstalling it, that you have the option of restoring from that backup. So let's get started here. We'll hit new wallet. We can create a password for this. Looks like they're going to force that, which is fine. It's good security. All right. And this is that 12 word recovery phrase. Now, when I do recovery phrases, I like to uh, write them down on a piece of paper, write the name of the wallet and the date, and then number your paper accordingly, right? There's 12 words to this backup phrase. This is a human readable format of the master private key that gets created and stored on our computer. So you'll want to make sure that you put this in a safe place if anything happens to the wallet or the computer. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and write those down. All right, so once we've got those written down, we can go ahead and uh, open up the wallet. And there we go. So you've got a list of all of the uh, compatible cryptocurrencies with the Atomic Wallet here. And it's very easy to deposit cryptocurrency in this wallet from an exchange or uh, from a different wallet. You'll notice here that uh, they do have a feature where we can exchange one cryptocurrency for another, kind of uh, a swap type of situation. Uh, they also have an option where you can buy crypto directly using uh, a Visa uh, through Simplex, a third party. And then you've got your uh, transaction history You've got uh, all of these tokens that are available for staking. These are the kind of tokens that once you deposit them in this wallet, you'll be able to earn interest right from this wallet. All right, and then also you can gain additional benefits in this wallet if you purchase and store AWC, which is the native cryptocurrency of the Atomic Wallet. It's a Binance coin based cryptocurrency and so if you buy it and store it in this wallet, you'll gain additional benefits for using this wallet. All right, and you can see here that uh, you can purchase AWC with Binance tokens. So you can either uh, transfer some Binance tokens into this wallet and use them to purchase the AWC, or if you have AWC in a different wallet, you can transfer it into this one. All right, and then they also uh, have suspended the airdrop feature uh, because of abuse. Uh, hopefully that'll get back soon. You've got a security section here where you can change your password. And then you've got this private keys section where you can reveal your private keys, which are uh, those 12 words that we copied down from the beginning. So if you lose your backup phrase, uh, you can recreate it from here but always a good idea to make sure you've got that backup phrase written down and stored in a safe place. Don't rely on the wallet to regenerate it for you. All right, so now that we've got everything set up, let's go ahead and put some Bitcoin in here. Uh, I'm gonna go over to a cryptocurrency exchange and uh, get a little uh, Bitcoin and transfer it into this wallet. All right, so I'm here on, in my Coinbase account and uh, there's a little bit of Bitcoin in my Coinbase account. So we'll use this as our uh, first transaction. So I'm gonna go over here to portfolio, uh, just go over here to my Bitcoin portfolio and uh, I'm gonna send all of it over to the wallet. So um, 
they want to know the address that I want to send the Bitcoin to. So we'll just go back over here to our atomic wallet. We'll go to our Bitcoin and just do a receive. And it's going to generate a Bitcoin receiving address for us. And we'll copy that into our clipboard. We'll go back over here to our exchange. We'll paste that address in. And then we'll click send. You can add an, an optional memo field here if you want to. We'll hit send. All right, they're going to give us an overview of that transaction. We'll hit send now. We'll enter our two-factor authentication from our Google Authenticator for our Coinbase account. Always enable two-factor authentication on any platform that supports it. Okay, and off that transaction goes, we'll hit done. And then we can just wait for the Bitcoin to come into our Atomic Wallet. And there we just got an alert from the wallet down there in the corner. Can't see it really, uh, but it's letting me know I have an incoming transaction. And then you can see up here my balance has adjusted. Uh, let's go ahead and dismiss this part of it. And we can see here that the Bitcoin has arrived in our wallet and is stored safely and securely on our own computer. And like I said, this wallet is desktop based and the master private key for the wallet is stored on this device on my computer so it's only as safe as your computer so you want to make sure that your computer is secured uh, physically that no one else has access to it that you've got a good password on your computer and good locks on your doors and then you'll want to uh, beef up the security of your computer uh, for online attacks so you'll want a good antivirus uh, good malware protection and you'll want to use your computer smart, right? Don't install a lot of adware or bloatware on your computer. Um, be selective about what you run on your computer. Some people will uh, reserve a completely separate computer only for crypto. Uh, that's a little extreme in my case, but uh, if it makes you feel better, that's a good policy as well to keep your crypto safe and secure. So if you want to know a little bit more about how this membership works, you can click this link here and it'll uh, pull up the web page that explains exactly how this membership reward program works. Basically, you're just going to need to put some AWC tokens in your wallet. And once you've got that minimum balance in your wallet and you use this wallet to make exchange swaps, you'll earn cash back into your AWC balance. All right, so depending on how much AWC you're holding in your wallet, uh, there'll be a certain percentage of cash back on your uh, swap transactions. All right, and then they're also capped, right? So if you go back over here, uh, there's a $100 cap uh, for the silver membership. So let's explore this a little bit. Uh, I do have some AWC, so I'm going to deposit it in the wallet. So uh, they mentioned that you can either uh, purchase it directly in the wallet or uh, buy it on Binance Dex. So you can purchase your AWC in the wallet or on Binance Dex, which means that if you've got it somewhere, you can just uh, put it in the wallet. So let's do that. All right, so remember if you're gonna do this and you're gonna transfer some AWC token into this wallet, it needs to be the BNB formatted AWC token. All right, you've got the blue one, which is a uh, ERC-20 based token. And then you've got the uh, yellow one, which is the BNB based, right? You can also search for it, right? And you can see there's two different types of token. You'll want this uh, yellow one, right? So we'll open that up, uh, we'll hit receive, and uh, we'll, that's our BNB based address. Let's go back over to our phone. <laughs> uh, we're going to do a send from our trust wallet. Uh, we're going to tap that little icon there uh, for the camera to open up and scan that QR code so it will autofill that address. I'll go ahead and send uh, 105 of my balance over, and that's going to be enough to maintain that blue membership. All right. So uh, we'll go ahead and hit done here and uh, click next and then we'll hit send.
right? And that happened really quick, right? Uh, going from Trust Wallet to Atomic Wallet. All right, there we go. Trust is letting me know I've sent some Atomic Wallet token. And there you can see I've got uh, a balance in the wallet now. So let's try it out. I'm going to drop a little bit of Binance coin in here. I'll click receive here. I'll go back over to my trust wallet. So once again, I can tap the camera icon to open up my camera and scan in that QR code. And then I'll just send five BNB that'll allow us to uh, make a few trades. See what happens. We'll click done here and next. And then uh, we'll tap send again. All right, now we can go over to the exchange and see what happens. I'm going to choose BNB as my payment coin. And as you can see here, if I make this transaction, I'll be rewarded with AWC. So uh, let's see which one will we like. I'll go ahead and buy a little of this comp. I've got the entire balance here, so uh, we can change this. We don't have to use the entire balance, right? We can just use maybe four of it right and it adjusts accordingly and there's our reward that we're going to get for making this transaction so i'm going to hit exchange here and it's processing now so i'm just going to wait i'm going to uh, get this token swap right i'm basically buying some comp with my bnb and because i'm holding uh, awc in the wallet uh, over a hundred i'm entitled to a cash back on this exchange so uh, we'll just be patient and wait for that exchange to complete. All right, so it looks like I got the comp up here at the top. We can sort our coins by balance if we want to, so that we can just at the top see the coins that we own. Uh, let's take a look at our Atomic Wallet token. Uh, and I don't see those rewards yet, right? But I do have those uh, coins, right? I've got the compound coin and I've got the Binance coin the leftover Binance coin and the uh, holding Atomic Wallet coin. Oh, actually, I think those rewards are paid uh, monthly, right? So let's look over here in settings. Uh, let's check this out here. Right, the rewards come in on a monthly basis. So they'll accumulate uh, for every swap that I make with it. All right, so uh, that's it. Uh, got the wallet set up. As I said, make sure you back your wallet up with your recovery phrase and keep it in a safe place. Uh, you can send and receive cryptocurrency uh, with from this wallet. You can swap tokens from within this wallet. Uh, if you're holding some Atomic Wallet token in the wallet, you'll earn rewards when you use the in-wallet exchange feature. So it's a pretty cool wallet. So if you have any questions about anything I did, please throw them up in the comments and I'll do my best to get them answered. Don't forget I do a live stream every Saturday night, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Please join me for the live Q&A from Michigan where you can throw out questions and I'll do my best to get them answered. Hope to see you there. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you'd like to subscribe to my channel, I would appreciate it. When you subscribe, there's a little bell that you can click that will allow you to be alerted whenever I post new content. Once again, thanks for joining me and hope to see you again soon.